Every Wednesday, the people come to receive groceries hi, and a touch hi. from Jesus. <laughs> the doors open and the ministry begins. Each visitor is greeted at the door and processed through our computer system. Our guests then take a seat and await an open counselor. Each visitor is encouraged by our counselors who listen to their cares and concerns and then receive prayer and ministry tailored to their needs. Over time, relationships develop and each of our guests become our friends. The last thing to occur is the food distribution. Each box weighs 45 pounds and is able to feed a family of four for five days. The Thursday meal ministry is different in some ways, but the same in that Jesus is the reason why we serve. Our guests are met at the door and encouraged to take a seat. Thoughtful and inspirational worship fills the room and you can sense the gentle presence of Jesus touching our guests. Tony encourages group participation in the memorization of scripture. An assortment of preachers have shared the Word of God with consistent clarity and inspiration. Hey, my name is John Alameda. Um, about a year and a half ago, Tony asked me to come speak at H Street, and I wasn't sure if I was the right person, but I said yes anyway. And Long story short, I've been coming back about once a month to be able to speak to the H Street um, ministry. And it's just been an amazing blessing. I love everything about going there. I love the atmosphere. I love the openness of the H Street uh, people. They're so open with their lives and they're so open to receive the message. And they all respond. These are the days we remember when the Lord saves souls and changes lives by the power of the Holy Spirit. We rejoice because we see the hungry being fed and the seeking heart coming to Jesus. We find peace and joy in our mission because we are the servants of the Lord. Hi everyone, it's Naya and I'm here at H Street Ministry and it's such a blessing to be here. We're here every Thursday night if you want to come on down. There's different ways you can serve if it's on your heart if you want to come and sing. Go ahead and do that. If you want to give a message, we would love that. I challenge everybody at our church to just come down and spend an hour here. Every Thursday night, your cup will run over with joy and blessings.